Welcome to Storytime with Tabitha. I'm so glad you're here. Today we're reading Today is Thanksgiving by P.K. Hallinan. Today is Thanksgiving and an icicle breeze nips at your window and whips up the leaves. Ah, what a morning the cold autumn haze bring visions of pilgrims and Indians and Mays. So wrap in a blanket and don your warm socks and pretend you're descending on old Plymouth Rock. And with football in tow, downstairs you go. Already the kitchen's beginning to swell with all the aromas you know oh so well. The scent of potatoes rides lightly on air. The fragrance of turkey encircles your hair. And the pies slowly baking, it's apple you're guessing, while celery stalks boil to help make the dressing. And you gladly pitch in rolling dough nice and thin. Then it's off to the den where the TV is tuned to a colorful parade full of floats and balloons. And you watch for a while, but soon it's all done. So you roll out the door for a stroll in the sun. And the chilly air tweaks your nose and your cheeks. Now here come your friends racing onto the scene. They're ready for football in their jerseys and jeans. So you quickly choose sides and mark off the goals using jackets and earmuffs and telephone poles. Then with one mighty kick, the game starts to click. And oh, what a game, so many trick plays. You sneak to the mailbox, then streak the wrong way. But then a long pass over driveway and grass is caught near the earmuffs a touchdown at last. And everyone sighs as you end in a tie. Later back home, you quickly get dressed and shine like a diamond to impress all your guests. And here they are now, it's the whole family clan. Why, it's dear Aunt Pansy and big Uncle Stan. And everyone's bearing some food for the sharing. Soon there are roomfuls of nephews and nieces. The cat's on the table, the dog's got the sneezes. And Uncle Tobias is asleep in the chair while Petey the parakeet creeps in his hair, and the whole house resounds with hilarious sounds. The time has arrived for the meal to begin, so you dash to your chair with a flare and a grin, and the hot giblet gravy brings loud oohs and ahs, but the sight of the turkey draws a round of applause. Then all heads are lowered as you join in a prayer, giving thanks for your blessings and the gifts waiting there. And with grace at the end, you whisper, Amen. The meal is a wonder, a cranberry dream. There's a crisp garden salad and fruit in whipped cream. And the portions keep coming, the rolls and the yams, till your tummy's so full it's too crammed to expand. But you let out a sigh and make room for pie. The evening soon fades into games and charades, and the clan drifts away like a tired parade. Then alas, it's all over, the laughter and fun, for now Auntie Pansy has hugged everyone. So you head up to bed, then stand in your room, gazing out the window at the gold harvest moon. And the last thing you do is smile and say, 
Thank you for Thanksgiving. What a wonderful day. The end. Thanks for listening.